Assalamu alaikum. I am Dr. Akim Gajil Hok, Assistant Professor, Department of Biochemistry. Now, a very critical condition occurs in a whole world wide. The coronavirus is now pandemic in this world. We are also affected. That means Bangladesh also affected, but we try to control it and very effectively now uh, at first my advice to all of my students is stay home stay safe so uh, <clears throat> we don't stop learning due to uh, according to our schedules and according to uh, the varsity uh, schedules your uh, first professional uh, examination will be held according to the schedule time so don't waste uh, your valuable time and stay learning in house now uh, shortly and summarily i uh, today i discuss about uh, some topics and some questions that is important for your past professional examination and uh, this is now for the eight batch uh, uh, students uh, who are appeared in first professional mbbs examination at first i want to tell you that the fifth and sixth card that means the clinical endocrinologic and clinical biochemistry and the fundamentals of molecular biology and genetics that already finished and you all uh, completed your uh, written exam and now uh, this fifth and sixth card all of you uh, I, I give the uh, questions in my last classes okay today I shortly uh, discussed about the first card that is biophysics and biomolecules my advice is uh, you collect all the previously exam questions and revise the question now at first of all the biophysics in biophysics uh, and biomolecules our topics are introduction to biochemistry SI unit acid base pH pk Anderson Hasselbus equation solution colloid crystalloid dialysis isotope carbohydrate lipid and fatty acid amino acid protein and enzyme coenzyme cofactor and isoenzyme uh, at first about uh, biochemistry introduction to biochemistry and SI unit here uh, you firstly read about a short note for SI unit then law of mass action the important question for law of mass actions are define law of mass action write about the example um, state and deduce the law of the mass action and give the biological importance and clinical importance of it then henderson hasselbach equation here uh, the important questions are that is very important uh, for your uh, professional exam and also for your viva that are state and deduce the henderson hasselbach equation and write about its importance several times in my class i told you about this henderson hasselbach equation and its importance okay now uh, gibbs donanic equilibrium here the important questions are straight and explain with important gibbs donan equilibrium short note about gibbs donan equilibrium in crystalloid and colloid here the important questions are define colloids and crystalloid with example what are the difference between crystalloid and colloids these questions is also very very important for your viva then 
list the properties or write the properties of colloids with example and the biochemical importance of colloids write the clinical application of dialysis short note about dialysis solution from solution the important questions are define and classify solution with example what are the difference between normal saline and normal solution define molar and osmolar solution and give the calculation to prepare 100 ml n by 10 sulfuric acid solution this is also important for your practical exam that means in the for traditional exam traditional practical also important uh, practical this is for also important for practical and written calculate the osmolarity of 5% glucose solution what is normal saline why it is called isotonic define standard solution with example calculate the osmolarity of normal saline prepare 100 ml 0.5% solution of glucose and calculate its osmolarity now some important short note these are normal solution molar solution plasma osmolarity normal saline diffusion isoelectric pH and standard solution now I discuss about shortly discuss about the pH this is very 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 important define pH how normal blood pH is maintained this question is also important for your viva short note about pH and pH scale calculate pH of a solution having 0.00459 mole per liter this question is important for you written write about the biomedical and clinical importance of pH now about buffer define and classify buffer give the composition of plasma buffer classify blood buffer how they control acid base balance compare and contrast the mood of action of bicarbonate and phosphate buffer mood of action that means the mechanism of action understand short note about bicarbonate buffer and the buffering capacity why bicarbonate buffer is very important for our body now about isotope define isotope with example what are the clinical importance of isotope what are the clinical application of isotope clinical application or clinical importance both are same so if the question is write about the clinical importance of isotope you can write the clinical application of isotope both are same understand okay now about biomolecules at first carbohydrate define and classify carbohydrate with example 
so <coughs> now about the biomolecules that means carbohydrate proteins and lipids in carbohydrate the important questions for your professional exams written and viva i shortly discussed define and classify carbohydrate with example <coughs> write down the important property of glucose with its importance what is invert sugar name the isomer of glucose with their formula give the structure of d glucose name the reducing and non reducing sugar classify monosaccharides write down difference between starch and glycogen short note that are very very important for your written anomeric carbon epimer isomer isomerism mutar rotation principle of benedict test or only benedict test invert sugar now about the protein define and classify protein with example biological importance of protein classify amino acid what are the formula of the amino acid in acidic alkaline and neutral ph name some biologically important peptides name the essential or write the essential amino acid what are the properties of amino acid with example write the important properties of protein name the bonds that stabilize tertiary structure of protein write about the function of plasma protein write about the structure of protein short note about protein that short notes are d naturation peptide bond isoelectric reaction isoelectric ph heat coagulation test quaternary structure of the protein or structure of the protein amino acid and nin hydrin reaction now about lipid define and classify lipid write about the properties of the lipid classify fatty acid and write about the important properties of fatty acid define and classify lipoprotein with their biological importance function and normal level name the prostaglandins what are the function of prostaglandins biomedical importance of cholesterol and the function of phospholipid how chylomicron is formed now there are some important short note in lipids saponification number iodine number apoprotein polyunsaturated fatty acid this is very very important triacylglycerol eicosanoate this is also very 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 important phospholipid very 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 important low density cholesterol prostaglandin now i discuss about enzyme main important questions i discussed about enzymes are define enzyme classify 
I will be classification of enzyme with example. Here the example is very very important. And this is also important for your viva. And in during your viva exam, uh, the external want to know about the classification of enzyme according to its example. So this is very very important. What are the factors that affect enzyme activity? And several times in my class, I told you that this is very important. And this question is also came in different segments. That means how temperature affect enzyme activity, how pH enzyme and uh, affect enzyme activity in this way portion is also came in your exam now write about the important difference between enzyme and coenzyme and during viva there is important question is arise that from where this coenzyme is derived so all of you know that these are derived from vitamin b complex What is allosteric effect? What is competitive and non-competitive enzyme inhibition? Write shortly on clinical importance of enzyme and name five clinically important enzyme. This is very 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 important for your written viva and also for your OSPI exam give few important example of utilization of enzyme inhibition in drug designing for as example hmg coa reductase inhibitor angiotensin converting enzyme inhibitor so at least five example all of you memorize at least five example understand name the clinical importance of creatinine phosphokinase lactate dehydrogenase alkaline phosphatase and the related viva questions are when this enzyme is rises in which condition uh, or in which disease these enzymes are rises in your blood or in patient's blood understand define isoenzyme with example and their clinical application for example creatinine phosphokinase this is a isoenzyme and creatinine phosphokinase 1, creatinine phosphokinase 2, and creatinine phosphokinase 3. They are present in different tissue. So these, these are very important for diagnosis of different type of the disease. What is covalent modification? Now about the short note of enzyme. Coenzyme, cofactor, KM, isoenzyme, enzyme inhibition, allosteric effect, and also Q10. So, uh, as a whole, I, uh, or I summarize uh, this first card. That means biophysics and biomolecules. In your first provisional exam, the mark distribution is very very important. There is written is 200, viva oral 100 and practical is 100. Here, OSP is 50 and traditional is 40 and your notebook is 10. Now, that's about second card. In your second card, food, nutrition, vitamin and minerals. Vitamin and minerals. This is very important. In vitamins, first define and classify vitamin. Name the vitamin B complex or water soluble vitamin with their active coenzyme forms. In your oral exam, 
the examiner want to know okay what are the antioxidant vitamins write down their function and their role in health and disease when the written question that is uh, what are the water soluble vitamin with their active coenzyme during your viva exam the examiner want to know individually that means they want to know told me about what are the uh, active form of vitamin b1 what are the active form of vitamin b6 so all of you properly read the active form of coenzyme due to this coenzyme is very important for the biochemical reaction and also uh, for our metabolism and they participate several types of metabolic reactions within the cell now next important questions are give source daily requirements function and deficiency disorder of vitamin a vitamin d vitamin e and vitamin k all of they are fat soluble vitamin that means without fat they are not absorbed in our blood now the give the function of vitamin b1 riboflavin cobalamin folic acid deficiency features due to water and fat soluble vitamin this question as a whole but in your exam the question is came individually understand write the steps of synthesis of vitamin d how vitamin a is associated with health and disease state briefly the food source and function of vitamin c the another name of vitamin c is ascorbic acid so this question is also came this way straight briefly about the food source and function of ascorbic acid and another important topics is dietary fiber define dietary fiber classification of the dietary fiber what are the importance of the dietary fiber this is very 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 important importance of clinical importance of dietary fiber nutritional importance of carbohydrate lipid protein and glycemic index of food and this glycemic index is very very important for diabetic patient according to this glycemic index of the food we make the diet plan of a diabetic patients so the question is arised about the short note of glycemic index of food or only glycemic index understand now about the minerals define minerals classify them with example source daily requirements and function of calcium show with a diagram the regulation of calcium in blood write the form of calcium in blood deficiency feature of calcium describe briefly about iron absorption and metabolism with diagram if you write the diagram you will got very good marks from examiners so diagram is very important diagram means pictures must be the picture is depicted with the elaboration writing understand what are the factors that influencing iron absorption 
Define press elements with example. State the importance of iodine in nutrition. Now about the short notes. The short notes are micronutrients, press elements, micro minerals, and titanium. Another important topic in this second card is malnutrition. Here you read classification and common nutritional disorder. And this common nutritional disorder according to our country. That means in common nutritional disorder that occur in Bangladesh. So you chronologically write the common nutritional disorder that occur in Bangladesh. Protein energy malnutrition, quashior core, marasmus, marasmeric quashikor, obesity. This is very very important for short note. That is obesity. Nutritional assessment and prevention of nutritional disorder. Basic concepts of nutrient. Define food define diet what is balanced diet what are the factors we considered for prepare a balanced diet essential dietary components total calorie calculation this is very very important for written exam in written the question is uh, came in this way write about the total calorie calculation of a medical student this is very important question recommended dietary allowance bmr what are the factors that are affecting bmr bmi how you calculate bmi and so all of it the uh, i summarize the question about food nutrition vitamin and minerals now i discuss about the third cards a third card is digestion absorption bioenergetics and metabolism at first the digestive juices that means, what are the enzymes that are secreted from salivary gland? What are the composition of gastric juice? What are the composition of pancreatic juice? What are the composition of the succus entericus? That means, what are the enzymes present in these juices? local hormones of gastrointestinal tract and this is also came as a short note that means local hormone of GI tract Mention the function of the following in fat digestion and absorption. How mycelia is formed? And you must depict the diagram when this question is arise. Short note about mycelia. Showing a diagram the mechanism of hydrocolic secretion in stomach. Here also diagram is necessary. Showing a diagram enterohepatic circulation. Give the composition of pancreatic juice. Why it is alkaline in nature. Short note about postprandial alkalinotide atrial natriuretic peptide zymogen lactose intolerance 
list or write the digestive enzyme for carbohydrate and lipid with their end products okay what are the carbohydrate splitting enzyme in gastrointestinal tract give the steps of digestion and absorption of lipid show in a diagram how bile helps in fat digestion and absorption this is very very important now i discuss about bioenergetics the important questions about bioenergetics are what is respiratory chain draw the respiratory chain mention the component sites of atp production in a respiratory chain and write about the inhibitor of respiratory chain define biological oxidation draw the sequence of coenzyme and carrier of respiratory chain name the oxidoreductases and define oxidative phosphorylation short note about biological oxidation oxidative phosphorylation cyclic adenosine monophosphate atp and redox potential now i shortly discuss about the important questions about carbohydrate metabolism in carbohydrate metabolism the important questions are mention the steps of tca cycle or citric acid cycle why tca cycle is called amphibolic pathway give its importance show with diagram the steps of tca cycle with total calculation of atp in a tca cycle name the catabolic pathway of carbohydrate metabolism short note about cori cycle galactosemia acetyl coa discuss about hexose monophosphate shunt this is also for important for short note what are the importance of hexose monophosphate shunt what are the source and fate of acetyl coa and pyruvate name the inborn error of carbohydrate metabolism write about the intermediate pathway of carbohydrate metabolism and write down the basic steps of pentose phosphate pathway define gluconeogenesis write down the substrate enzyme site and important of this pathway they are important uh, things is that all of you please memorize the name of the substrate enzyme site and important of all the biochemical reaction in carbohydrate metabolism lipid metabolism and in protein metabolism now define glycolysis with atp calculation glycogenesis and how it is regulated this is also came as a short note write short note about glycogenesis gluconeogenesis this is also important for short note glycogenolysis it's importance and fate of glucose 6 phosphate short note about glycogen storage disease calculate the total atp production from oxidation of one mole of glucose write the major steps of glycogenesis what are the importance of liver glycogen A important question 
T is for bye bye is what are the difference between liver glycogen and muscle glycogen? Describe the metabolic fate of glucose after absorption. Explain glucostatic function of the liver with its mechanism and importance. What is normal blood glucose level? Show in a diagram the regulation of glucose in blood. If you don't told about the normal blood glucose level, normal blood glucose level in viva exam, this is very very pathetic. So this is the basic. You know about properly the normal blood glucose level. Understand? Role of liver in integrated metabolism. What is lactose intolerance? Mention some important glucose transporter with their function. Write about anaerobic glycolysis. Give its importance. What are the state of metabolic changes during fasting? Now about the protein metabolism. Step of urea cycle with diagram. Write down the causes and feature of ammonia intoxication. This is also a important short note. That is ammonia intoxication. Uh, write about amino acid pool with diagram what are the function of the amino acid pool what are the source and fate of amino acid pool define trans amination and deamination write down about the mechanism of disposal of ammonia Why ammonia intoxication occur in liver failure? That means, why liver failure causes ammonia intoxication? Mention the catabolic pathway of protein metabolism. What are the source and fates of ammonia in our body? This is also important for your OSP exam. Show in a diagram the steps of amino acid metabolism. What is nitrogen balance? Mention the fate of amino acid nitrogen. What is oxidative deamination? Short note about phenyl ketonuria, alkaptonuria, nitrogen balance non-protein nitrogenous substances and trans amination now i discuss about the important question about lipid metabolism define lipolysis mention the steps of beta oxidation of the fatty acid of 16 carbon with its atp calculation How fatty acids are catabolized in our body? Show the steps in a flowchart. Explain why ketoacidosis occur in starvation. What are the ketone bodies? What is ketosis and what is ketoacidosis? Write in brief about the origin and fate of ketone bodies. What is ketosis, ketonemia, and ketonuria? Describe how ketoacidosis occur in an uncontrolled diabetes mellitus. That means the mechanism of action of ketoacidosis in an uncontrolled diabetes mellitus patient. Classify the plasma lipoprotein and apoprotein. 
Why? Why high density lipoprotein cholesterol is good for our body and low density lipoprotein cholesterol is harmful for our body? This is also important for your viva exam. Mention the steps with diagram of very low density lipoprotein metabolism, high density lipoprotein metabolism or about HDL, reverse cholesterol transport, reverse cholesterol transport. This is very, very important. What are the source and fate of cholesterol? How it is synthesized in liver? What do you mean by river cholesterol transport? Show with diagram the steps of biosynthesis of cholesterol. What are the role of blood cholesterol in health and disease? Show with the diagram or write about the diagram of synthesis and metabolic fate of chylomicron. Mention the steps of ketogenesis. How are they utilized? What are the eicosanoids? How they are produced? Now about the short note. The important short notes are diabetic ketoacidosis, ketone bodies, beta oxidation, pyruvate dehydrogenase complex and reverse cholesterol transport. So, uh, shortly I uh, discussed about the CART3 that means digestion, absorption, bioenergetics and metabolism. Now about your fourth CART. That means renal biochemistry, body fluid, electrolytes, and acid base balance. A very important card. In renal biochemistry, the important questions uh, that is um, very, very important for your written and viva. These are, what are the functions of the kidney? This is a basic question. What are the autoregulation of renal blood flow? Difference between extracellular fluid and intracellular fluid. Define glomerular filtration rate. What are the factors that influence glomerular filtration rate? write about the buffer that acting on kidney with diagram write about the mechanism of acidification of urine explain the role of kidney in regulating body water How kidney convert isotonic glomerular filtrate into concentrated urine? Short note about renal plasma clearance, tubular load, plasma load, osmolar clearance, free water clearance, extracellular fluid electrolytes, renin angiotensin mechanism now about the body fluid and acid base balance the important questions are classify body fluid name the regulatory mechanism of the body fluid this is very very important write down the indicator dilution method of body fluid Show with a diagram the regulation of plasma osmolarity. That means write about plasma osmolarity with diagram.
write down the ionic difference between RBC and plasma. How does renin angiotensin mechanism regulate body fluid? Short note about anion gap, atrial net theoretic peptide, compensated respiratory acidosis, compensated metabolic acidosis, osmolarity of the blood, normal saline, serum sodium, partial pressure of carbon dioxide, plasma electrolytes, water deficit. Write about the role of kidney in regulation of acid-base balance with diagram. What are the function of sodium in the body? What are the how sodium is regulated in by kidney or hormonal regulation of sodium? Classify body fluid compartments. How extracellular fluid compartments is regulated? Compare and contrast between extracellular fluid and intercellular fluid. Write about the blood pictures of a compensated metabolic acidosis. Write about the blood picture of compensated metabolic alkalosis and also write about the blood pictures of respiratory acidosis and alkalosis. That means when a patient is came to you, how you diagnosed that the patient is suffering for metabolic acidosis or metabolic alkalosis, respiratory acidosis or respiratory alkalosis by seeing the parameter of acid base balance or the parameter that is present in the blood. That means the pH, partial pressure of the carbon dioxide, bicarbonate ion concentration and through the anion gap. Import, uh, the important topics is regulation of fluid volumes, all the volume disorders. All of you read the volume disorders elaborately. This is very, very important for your written viva and OSPI exam. What is water intoxication? This is also important for short note. Serum electrolytes and their reference ranges. These are sodium, potassium, calcium, and phosphate. And briefly uh, know about the regulation of sodium, potassium, phosphate, and calcium, in which the calcium regulation is also very, very important. All the acid base disorder, simple acid base disorder, mixed type of acid base disorder and compensation of acidosis and alkalosis in our body. Short note about base excess and anion gap. How you calculate the anion gap? In your exam, uh, the question is arising in the way that uh, a patient came with uh, emergency department and uh, the blood pictures, sodium is, the uh, potassium is, and the bicarbonate ion concentration is given. And also the partial pressure of the carbon dioxide is also given. Then to see this blood picture, you must diagnose the patient. The, is he or she suffering metabolic acidosis or alkalosis, respiratory acidosis, al alkalosis. So, these topics are very, very important for your written and viva. Due to uh, in your uh, practical life, due to in your practical life, 
when you become intern doctor uh, you face the uh, this type of patients they are came in the emergency department you deal this patients to, to so you uh, have must know about proper knowledge about uh, the acid base disorders the parameters that is required for diagnosis of a uh, patient who are suffering acid base disorder due to your simple mistake the patient will be expired so this is very very important what are the arterial blood picture value of diabetic ketoacidosis why children quickly dehydrated in diarrhea state briefly about the major mechanism of regulation of osmolarity by the kidney write the formula of sodium and potassium deficit in dehydration so uh, this question uh, those question i already discussed you should not only read this question you must collect all the previous questions of professional exam cut final exam term final exam and please please solve all the questions then uh, all of you can uh, overcome the conditions uh, now a emergency condition is uh, going on in our country but the my my first advice is don't waste your time due to your first professional exam must be held in uh, the schedule proper schedule time so don't waste the time okay so uh, thank you stay home uh, keep safe and always wear mask when uh, go to uh, uh, outside and wash your hand uh, every 2 hours with soap Okay assalamu alaikum